Trying to figure out what to do on the weekend? Well, this is where we ask the question, what's happening, Halton? To Carla from FM 101 Milton. And Carla, let's start right by you guys, because the Milton Farmer's Market is on the move this weekend. That's right. They're making a little bit of room for another event that'll be happening at the fairgrounds uh, this weekend. So that means for the farmer's market, it's actually going to be happening a lot smaller this Saturday, but it's still happening. So that's always great to hear. They did make an effort to make sure that it would still happen on Saturday. It's going to be at the former TSC location on Main Street and Bronte Street. And it's going to be a lot smaller, a lot less vendors, but it's still a good chance to go out there and uh, support local. So it's happening from 8 a.m. until 12 p.m. this Saturday. And if you can't get enough of shopping, there's something going on in Oakville called Shop It Like It's Hot, which already the name has won me over. Yeah, love the name, whoever created this event, genius idea. Uh, but it's happening at Oakville Place in the back parking lot, and there's going to be over 25 vendors involved. A great way, again, to support local. There's going to be swag bags for the first 25 shoppers that show up. Now, moving over to Burlington, uh, I would say you might want to drive there, but not drive up and down Brant Street because it's just simply going to be full of cars. Yeah, and it's going to be closed down just for pedestrians as well. It's the sixth annual car show, uh, which is so cool to see. They're going to have cars there from every era. My favorite is always the old school Corvette, so I'm hoping that there's some of those there. You know what I like to get? A decked out VW bus. That's oh, my ride right there, Carla. That's cool. I've Pack seen those up, on the road. Go on a road trip because you can sleep in the back and it's got everything you could ever want, or at least everything I could ever want because I'm a strange <laughs> man. Uh, and one thing, two things that I also want are ribs and beer. And if I want those this weekend, I should head up to Georgetown. You should. It's the perfect combo. And I was actually at one of the rib fests this past weekend last week and uh, it was amazing. It's good to see, you know, everybody come out to support uh, an event like this and eat ribs, get beer. So it's happening in Georgetown uh, this weekend and there's gonna be live entertainment as well. And uh, you can play some games, uh, again, just eat lots of ribs. So you were just at a rib fest, you said. So if you're headed there this weekend, like, like what do you go and get? Okay, well, I get all the deep fried stuff. I get deep fried Oreos churros that were there as well um so i'm always there for like the treats and everything ice cream as well so you know typically you would go for the ribs but i'm just there for you know just everything <laughs> carla goes to rib fest sans the ribs though <laughs> <laughs> All right, good stuff. Well, listen, there's a lot to do this week. Can get out there and experience it. Carla, always a pleasure, and we'll talk to you again next week. Sounds good. See you then. 